Now on BBC One, the news in London and the South East with Mike Emberley and Charlie Figgis. Tonight, first the cervical screening scandal, now another medical blunder. A hospital admits removing the breasts of two healthy women. Also tonight, how much for a cab on New Year's Eve and why there still won't be enough of them. Welcome to the programme. It is already at the centre of Britain's worst cervical smear test scandal. Now, the Kent and Canterbury Hospital has admitted two patients there had their breasts removed unnecessarily. But an independent review of pathology services has concluded that statistically, the hospital's mistakes fall within the expected range of error. Good to end us some good news. Just before we go, a look at the top stories in London and the South East tonight. Hundreds of women treated at the Kent and Canterbury Hospital are to have their test results re-examined. The hospital has admitted removing the breasts of two healthy women. Drivers of black cabs in London are warning there'll be a severe shortage on New Year's Eve, despite an announcement today that they'll be allowed to charge double fares. That's about it from us tonight. Uh, I'll be back with more South East News, of course, at uh, around 9.25. And we'll both be back tomorrow. Now back to Hugh for the national and international headlines. Good night.